Hey everybody, it's Alicia and I am sitting here with our um, featherweight Gale. This machine was actually sent to me um, not too long ago um, to be cleaned up. She had grease and all of the oil spots, so that was really fun. Um, but we got her cleaned up and put the oil where the oil needs to go and the grease where the grease needs to go. So she looks a lot better. And before she gets sent out onto her home, I will briefly go over um, the machine again with some wax and then any fine detailing that might be left on the machine. And um, we went ahead and we set the tension. So here is some of the stitches that we did and we're going to demonstrate some stitches for you. I do know that Gail's owner, Gail, had some questions on what type of needles to use in the featherweight. And these are the ones that um, I use and I'm sure many of you out there. Um, these are the Smith needles, uh, the 8020 Universal. Um, you can get these at Joanne Fabrics. I know that uh, they have an app for your phone and if you use that, there's always like a 40 or 50% off coupon so that makes these a lot more reasonable. You can also order them through the Featherweight Shop. I know they have them on there. And then if you're an Amazon Prime member, I know that Amazon carries them as well. And then this was her case. Um, it cleaned up really, really well. I am going to fine detail over the latches just to get off any residue um, that it might have. I'll turn this around so you can see the back of it. So the case does look so much better. It's really shiny and black. And I'll show you the inside and then we can get onto the stitches. So there's the inside of the case. So now what we'll go ahead and do is we'll do our um, general forward and backward stitching um, along with a little bit of meandering. And if you have any questions or concerns, Gail, please let me know once you see this. Um, we want to make sure that this machine is perfect for you. this thread and then we will um, go ahead and do the backwards so you can see that as well this machine has a really beautiful stitch um, and it didn't take too much in terms of adjusting the tension now do keep in mind that, you know, you will have to do some adjustments to tension, especially if you use different thread, uh, fabric, and things along that nature. But um, there they are. The stitches are really beautiful on that machine. And so she is just gonna go through a little bit more fine detailing and then this machine will be ready to be reunited and to get stitching and sewing and um, making some awesome projects with um, Gail. And we've also been sent her um, sister, Grace, that we will start on um, sometime either this weekend or early next week. So thank you all for being a part of Featherweight 38 and we are so happy to have all of you here.